what was God's plan In my life one day you revealed to me You'll make me see The plans he had for me I'm never gonna understand What was God's plan In my life one day you revealed to me You'll make me see The plans he had for me God led to me in my mother's womb Cause he know the plans that he wanted me pursue But I guess I had different objectives in life from the time I knew Yo guys and what's the vibes? It's your boy Kev here repping for the TKS fam aka Harris family Your favorite family channel Guys your boy is back with his videos And today I'm gonna carry you guys somewhere That I think most of you have never ventured before uh, Studying if they already do it eh? Hmm Anyway, yeah, listen, listen to this. We have crossed the 400. Um, I saw we reached 410. Now, congratulations to the winner, of course. And we still want to link with you. Um, we on the journey to 500, guys. So continue to support. We hope up to this time that you guys are liking our videos. Now, we may not be dropping videos as often, but we do try to bring good content to you guys all right so continue to support the channel continue to subscribe to the channel click that notification bell that you could be aware of all our uploads and we are looking forward to more changes in our content and what it is we want to bring to the platform here on youtube to you guys all right so stay tuned for that but however today as i said i want to go somewhere that i think you know most of you have never really ventured and seen before and you're gonna see exactly why i want to go there because there's something interesting about this place that i want you guys to see and just how spooky to me the first time i saw it guys it was a bit spooky a bit scary in the sense where the location and just what i saw was kind of mind bothering and i'd say i wasn't gonna adventure in that place again but i said i'm gonna carry them and see let them see how it is it is be highlight let's highlight some things here all right but I was just show you where that garbage is that there is no garbage on this side or you see any big ladies there or you know that is water right there right? like I showed you last time but these are different road right it's a nice quiet place uh, you guys gonna see here coming up here gonna see and these areas people already come down so we must see all of this here so there we're actually seeing somebody living here um, I think this person will be planting if you look in the back there plantation but the problem is here guys is that the flood look at this they just at the side of the road here how high the drain is the water level here very high i'm going to take you guys across to this place here and show you how there is look at this guys a key man he now going in the water there now the key head right there right there that's watching this scene guys i love these kind of things i thought when i come out the van he would have moved but mr man brave so i wonder how deep there is boy Wow, so I see he head there. I think that's a baby. Let me see if I go forward. If he go, yeah, he go on there, he go on. That is it under the water. <laughs> so, what is the interesting thing about here, right? Is the fact that where I'm going, the water level of the road is actually the same height of the road. This is real interesting, guys. Now you see what I did, I said, I just show you I came on. Right down here in the back of Esiko is full of it. 
but I like these kind of adventures. Why? Because these things, it, it makes me feel good inside. I like to see these things. So it, the more I see nature at its best and these animals and creatures or whatever the case, I just love it. It have two birds actually watching me that does pick you. I'm gonna show you them. I'm gonna show you them. Where you see them there? Tattoo of them here. And uh, it look like they have a nest close by. So if I even venture to go there now without the van, they're going to try to pick me as hell, guys. Not me, Papa. Selling oil. So as I was selling oil, this is what I like. These are the kind of things I like. I like the opposite side of the, the beauty and the attraction. I mean, I like the beauty here, yeah, but what does what does fire me more up about these vlogs is the, the actual opportunities to see these places. And I, I promise, as I go along, I'm going to carry you guys on every opportunity that I get for you guys to see exactly what takes place. Alright, so let me move on a little forward. Our next one there. next game on guys guys this place is so creepy horse look i i try to understand look at the height of this water to the bridge right there right there no? my word you guys can imagine i can imagine how deep and how scary inside this water is mm -mm 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 -mm. yeah we still moving guys There is about the turkey man I see in here. Since I come down here. And let's try to zoom in. So you guys can see it. Alright, this, this this place infested with them in the back here guys. So my advice, if you come in here, just be careful. I think Cayman's not ready. Um they don't really um uh, how to say. Really interfere with you. Um I think there's peaceful animals in the sense that but if you trouble them I think they will bring trouble to you. Alright, so once they feel as though you're going to harm them, well yeah. And don't, don't try to go and hold them there so because you'll get a nice bite. Trust me. Very hard. Very hard bite. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm lining up an interview for you guys, right? For you guys to hear feedback of what basically takes place in the back here and what to expect. This man going to come and tell you and give you a little history about any back this is what is interesting about this place guys this narrow road here and to the side of this road on the two sides is a river around and what's our narrow horse and let me tell you something guys we drove down here about a year ago probably it wasn't so bad but guys this place has some history take a listen of what to expect in the back here and what takes place down in the back here yeah man yeah um this is a place of wildlife now mm -hmm. um it does have capybara hmm. cayman plenty wow cascado hmm. cuscarab yeah tilapia um anaconda anaconda yeah it does have <laughs> yeah it uh -huh. have all different types of bird yeah. The crowd what is eat the conks, a brown one flying there, watch. You seen it in the distance yeah, yeah. But, uh, And also him there's now with yeah. a kind of brown bottom and uh, right. yeah. It have hmm. all different egret. Hmm. You know, it have uh, these birds, people as mine, Pico. Right? right. The Pico plat. All different types of birds, hundreds of different species. Hmm. You know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> and if you take a little walk down here, you will see the capybara shit to believe. Uh -huh. Come and see. It has plenty on the bank by me. Watch, capybara shit. Watch how it is. So you will know it's not wow. joke at all. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? Well, people are tied a cow too. Okay. Who have the cow on the height, they just tied on the bank. They can't go down lower than that. These are the morning. Oh. You see, the dark yeah. and late evening. Okay. Because this hour. 
you know, you just have people come in and they, right. they know so that. They, they yeah, know they that. know the timing of yeah, the, the crowd, have, whatever the case. Yeah. People, although hunting season closed, you know, people yeah. just shoot illegal. Oh. All this thing, you can't tell them that we know who is who, you know. Right. All different people come in, you know, and when okay. hunting season opens, yeah. they come in by the hundreds. <laughs> Yeah, sorry, I ain't have my next phone or a senator here. Yeah, um, yeah. But the phone mash up it. A new Samsung is fallen and mash up. There's no problem, man. There's yeah, no problem. So you can see the pet copy bar sitting there, mm -hmm. dry up. Early morning. So wow. you'll know the wildlife it is have here. Yeah. Now. You know? Wow, guys, we're going down in the. Well, in the you see, if you can go further. Go further, yeah. It's muddy. Yeah. You know? The place is very muddy. So they hmm. just come out all the. Is our animal? The between the foot have fins like wow. the home is in the water but they just oh. come in the land they just come all in the bank lie down play all yeah. different sizes you know wow. all different sizes and you know i never know all of this this take place in the back here yeah well ooh, look at how close the highway is right and hardly anybody aware that mm -hmm. it have a place like this true down here. true so how long you know? how long you from in the back here from a little boy yeah. from school days so you know, you know, you know, in the back here, like the yeah, palm of your yeah. hand. <laughs> now, now it ha you will meet people older than me down here. Right. But them still is Johnny come lately. You know who come and get a piece exactly. of land later yeah. after. They're not like but you. Yeah, I squat cemented here. here. Yeah. yeah, I squat here from a little boy school oh, days. Guys. You know, and I'm still here. You so, know, I just come down and clean my land. That, is a, that, that, that place they get um, flood out there? Yeah, it had, it had watermelon and tomato. You could see it, still see the tomato sticks. Yeah. Eh? You see the pieces wow, of water? Yeah, stick out right? there. Yeah, but the boy get flood out. Like me, yeah, I had boy. oak crow, that flood out. You so know? it does have a lot of um, that, that issue with you guys flooding back here. Yeah, well, um, the people that get mm. paid to operate the right. flood gate not do nope. it to do that right we're not supposed to do it mm -hmm. but to save we crop yeah we have to go and do it right you know so and that is the case hmm. you know all over that is the case certain areas so as he has explained to my guys the road itself you can't really tell yeah, because of how the, yeah how the water yeah. you know and this is on both sides eh, guys both sides of the road what we're dealing with here here and on that side. For your crop. Yeah. You have to study how to get it out. To get the water a, out. Yeah, this is a low lying area. Yeah. You understand? So this problem, the problem as I say is not getting the water. It's getting yeah, it it's out. It's getting it out. My you know? gosh. Now I used to plant here at a time some years ago, mm. all in rain season. Mm. But apparently all the drains need cleaning. You <laughs> understand? Yeah. For the water to free flow in the river. Right. But that that not happening. They're not doing it. You know, I don't know the reason. Probably well, them know better than me. Well, you know, they, I can they, only tell you what I know. Yeah, doing. exactly. You understand? So you okay. you 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 more reside in the back here. Yeah, I across there. there yeah. Okay, okay. I across there. But I'm aware of the whole place. Yeah. You know, <laughs> I know what's going on. Wow, 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 wow. I am. Front of this. Yeah. But And how deep this water is, boy? This water? Yeah. This is about there, about this, about chest about height. About chest height? Chest height, yeah. Okay, okay. But the, um, just recently, it was higher than that because we could just cover all the bridge. Yeah, yeah, yeah you know? boy, because I'm watching the height yeah. of the bridge here yeah. as it is here. And next thing, you see the bridge is out watch. Yeah, this. The steel beam <laughs> that's holding up the bridge. Yeah. They hear years and it's rattling. It rattling gradually, so you yeah. get a belly. Wow. Now soon, one day, I don't know for how long, it will fall in <laughs> it the river. It will fall, it will cave in. It's yeah, true. you know. I know you guys, you're seeing the belly here. I don't want it to happen when a truck passing over. Yeah. You know, you could see the curve. Yeah, you seen it there? Yeah. Yeah. Because it was not so, it was <laughs> straight. Right. You know, I don't think I could tell you. It's true, but and exactly when it built, yeah. it would have been straight. Yeah, what they have to do when they hmm. build an bridge. Oh good guys, it's making so hot out there. So glad to be back in the ACL van. Now listen guys, I was talking with Steve, right? I didn't uh, I didn't get the part when does he say name, but his name is Steve. Now, you know what he was explaining to me in the back here 
it is so difficult for farmers. It is so difficult for what is taking place. There are so many things that are taking place with regards to the pump, the a pump situation in the back here. People trying to, you know, like um, basically sabotage the farmers in the back here. And it's a lot. Listen, and you guys saw for yourself. There's a lot of water in the back here. And <laughs> I remember when he was talking about the amount of things with the anaconda. I, I didn't know it had anaconda, anaconda in the back here, you know, people. That was one of the things that was least on my mind, you know. But he said this is in the back here is a habitat and it is a home to them. They don't interfere with these creatures and animals in the back here. So it's not a place for it to vent here. Um, you only have to be brave. I faced my, my fear today. And while walking along that narrow road, I can't go any more down because, as he was saying, the water covers the road and pieces of the road have broken off so you you can't drive to say and to walk would be a dangerous thing as you heard them said the the water is chest height in certain areas it can be deeper in certain areas all right so i just say let me bring oil along on this vlog today just to highlight the the unseen places of trinidad and tobago and where you would not know about um i hope i can meet him if i come back here because i want to do a thorough vlog in the back here to see you know that's a show more things and highlight more issues that is taking place in the back here but i hope you guys enjoyed it right uh, i feel i definitely feel better because it's something that i wanted to a challenge that i wanted to take up and i, I take up the challenge and i came in the back here guys so yeah there's your boy kevin another video and stay tuned for more because i'm going to be going places that you guys have not very much want to vent here in Trinidad and Tobago and you're gonna see exactly what what sweet 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 TNT is really really about and the things that people face and you know the challenges that they face around all right so you don't know undivided and together forever Cow. boom